The Harp in the South The Harp in the South is the debut novel by Australian author Ruth Park. Published in 1948, it portrays the life of a Catholic Irish-Australian family living in the Sydney suburb of Sarai Hills, which was at that time an inner-city slum. Publication History The Harp in the South was published, initially, in the Sydney Morning Herald in 12 daily installments, beginning on 4 January 1947, after winning a competition run by that newspaper. The prize was £2,000. It was controversial with readers writing to the newspaper on the basis of the synopsis, even before the serialization started. Delia Falconer writes that the Herald published 43 responses, a symposium, and a daily tally of pro and con letters 68 for 54 against. It was published in book form in 1948 by Angus and Robertson, who balked at the novel but had to honor a gentleman's agreement to publish the winner. Nonetheless, it has become a classic and has never been out of print. Characters Huey Darcy, married to Margaret Darcy. Huey often becomes drunk after work, and his best friend is Patrick Diamond, even though Patrick is Protestant and he is Catholic. He is the father of Rowena and Dollar. Huey wants to get out of Sarai Hills and back to the bush, but he has a family to support, so is trapped. Margaret Mama Darcy, mother of Rowena and Dollar, mother in law of Charlie Rav. She is a devout Catholic and, although generally accepting, sometimes fights with Patrick Diamond, their lodger, over his religious beliefs. Rowena Roy Darcy, E. Darcy, married to Charlie Rav, they have one child, Moira, known as Mati. In her youth, she was courted by Tommy Mendel, but after sleeping with her, he disappeared. Roy secretly works at two jobs to save enough for an abortion when she discovers she is expecting Tommy's baby, but at the last minute cannot go through with it. On her way home, she is attacked and savagely beaten by a group of sailors and loses the baby. Charlie Rav. Charlie is assumed to be part Aboriginal, although he does not know his parents as he was taken away as a baby and put in a home. He is married to Rowena Darcy, whom he met when her younger sister, Dollar, took part in a radio quiz show, Junior Information Please. Roy was feeling sick, and he helped her outside for air. Charlie knows there is no racial prejudice with Roy, but Margaret does not accept him at first, and Dollar is angry with him for stealing Roy from her. Dollar Darcy. Dollar is the youngest in her family. A very bright girl, she aspires to get a good education and escape from Sarai Hills. She is Auntie Tomati Roy's child and good friends with elderly Chinese greengrocer, Lick Jimmy, Patrick Diamond, the Darcy's fervent Protestant lodger. Every St. Patrick's Day, he gets drunk and verbally abuses Mrs. Darcy. When he suffers a stroke, Lick Jimmy performs an emergency bleed by cutting open a vein to ease the pressure. Pat was unaware of this, as he had passed out because Huey also drunk. Miss Shaley? Mother to disabled Johnny Shaley, she constantly abuses him. When he is knocked down and killed, she seems relieved rather than upset. Later, Roy sees her flagellating herself and crying Johnny's name. She marries a Swedish man named Gunnarsson. Sequel and Prequel In 1949, Ruth Park published Poor Man's Orange as a sequel to The Harp in the South. A prequel, Miss Us, was published in 1985. Adaptations 1949 Stage Adaptation Park and Leslie Reese collaborated on a stage adaptation of The Harp in the South. It was first presented at the Independent Theatre in Sydney in March 1949. 1964 British TV version The book was adapted for British TV in 1964. It was directed by an Australian, Alan Burke, with many Australians in the cast including Ed Devereaux. Alan Burke had written a musical adaption of Harp in the South which has not been professionally produced. Cast Ed Devereaux Vero as Huey Darcy, Brenda Dunrich as Mama Darcy, Bettina Dixon as Deli Stock, Veronica Lang as Roy Darcy, Andy Ho as Lick Jimmy, 
Muget de Brea as Rosa Siciliano, George Roderick as Luigi Siciliano, Colette Martin as Dollar Darcy, Moya O'Sullivan as Miss Shaley, Bill Levis as Johnny Shaley, Kevin Brennan as Patrick Diamond, Lou Luton as Tommy Mendel, 1986 and 1987 miniseries, The Harp in the South and its sequel Poor Man's Orange were adapted into TV miniseries, the former in 1986, the latter in 1987. Cast 2018 Stage Adaptation Kate Mulvaney adapted The Harp in the South, its prequel and sequel into a six-hour play over two parts. It was first produced by the Sydney Theatre Company at the Rosslyn Packer Theatre from August 2018, directed by Kip Williams.